Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. So today I have another grocery haul for you. Um, this is the groceries that I ordered online from Woolworths. Um, I chose the pickup, so with that I ordered on the Thursday and I picked up after work on the Friday. So if you enjoyed this video, please give it a thumbs up. If you haven't already, please hit that subscribe button and I will show you what I bought. So here we're going to start off with this end. So this end we have our deli and meat kind of stuff. So um, what I've got here is that I've got some salami sticks or twiggy sticks. The boys love these in their school lunches so I always get these. I can also eat these on keto so good option for me as well. Um, here we've got some here we've got some bacon, these are the middle rashers, so these are the long strips um, that have the rind on them. So just got some of them, we use that in pretty much all of our meals. Um, I've got some shaved, I actually got, um, they gave me sliced ham instead of shaved, which I have no problem with. That's fine, so my youngest likes to have ham cheese toasties in the morning, so this is vital. Um, we also use it for other things. Um, I've got, this is the full fat mint, so it's the 82-18 percentage to fat. Um, but I've also got the leaner mints, which um, the, t the boys have these as well. So, um, for this week, um, I think we're having spaghetti and tacos. Um, I'll show you my meal plan in a minute. But yes, yeah, so I've got two minced, um, two minces for the boys for their dinners. Um, I've also bought this steam fresh um, fish. So I thought this would be good to try. It's fairly good at macros. So 2.7 grams of car carbs and 1.3 grams of sugar and 12, uh, 11 grams of fat. So I thought that would be a good option for me for one, one of my meals. Um, also got some garlic bread which will go with one of the mince dishes. Uh, up the back here we've got two cats and two dogs so we've got some dry cat food and some tin food for them. Also got them some little dentist stick treats which they love. Uh, moving on to some produce. I don't have a lot of produce this week. But I did get some spinach so that I can add it to some meals. I like adding it to my eggs or just throwing it in to hide it so the boys can't see it and they it um, yeah, gives them a little bit of veggies. Um, I got a zucchini so I can make zoodles. I've got um, some spaghetti mint meat in the freezer for myself while I'm on keto. It's just an easy option. I just um, This will probably do two meals um, and I just leave the zoodles in the fridge and they last for a few days when I want to eat it the next day, next time. Got a bag of onions, we use these for a lot of our meals, for spaghetti, for tacos, yeah, so I so needed some more of them. Uh, Granny Smith apples, so um, the boys take these to school in their lunches. Then I've got some body wash, so this is for the boys, they like that one because it um, does their hair as well. I got this one, I usually like to get something a bit feminine. Um, and this is one that I saw, so I thought I'd grab that one. Um, and this is for the hubby. It's a little bit more musky, so I'm not a big fan of that one, so I've got him that one. Um, up the back, we got some Cheerios. That's the cereal that my oldest likes to eat. Um, I don't know why, but we've had problems with getting it lately. Um, we use this milk, so it's a smarter white milk, so 2% fat, so um, I'm guessing it's similar to what Americans, when you guys say, oh, it's 2%. Guessing that's kind of similar to what that is. Um, what have I got here? So I've got some pasta packet for one of our meals during the week. Can't remember exactly what it was for, but yeah, I've got that. Um, I have cream in my coffee in the morning so I grabbed some more of that today I had my coffee and my cream was off so I had to throw out my coffee which was very sad um, 
I've got these um, cheese slices, which the boys have on their sandwiches and the hubby likes to eat. They also have it as snacks as well. So when they're feeling a bit peckish, I always just say, just go grab a piece of cheese. So that's what we use. It's the, um, it's not the light ones. We don't like the light ones. They're a bit more car like cardboardish. These ones are a little bit more edible. Um, I also got this cracker barrel. I've been really wanting more sharper cheese other than my Jarlsberg. Um, so I got this one to try. It's supposed to be a really, um, really sharp type of cheese. So I'm going to enjoy that one hopefully. Um, also got these Balia yogurt packs. The youngest likes yogurt and he takes these in his lunches. Um, I've got two bags of cauliflower and broccoli. Um, so these ones I just usually add to my lunches or any, any of my meals really. I also throw them in my meat and broccoli bake. So I um, like having a few of these on hand just for when I need them. Um, next I've got hot dogs. We have hot dogs on a Wednesday. That's our sports day. So um, hot dogs is just a really easy thing that I can prep before I go. Um, and then the boys come back from their baseball, have something to eat quickly, and then rush out the door again. Um, I've got some coconut milk because I do have some of that chocolate gummy mixture from Low Carb Emporium that I mix with this to make little chocolate gummies. So really delicious. So I had to get some more coconut oil and this was on at half price. So I grabbed that. I sometimes put it in my coffee. Um, sometimes add it to treats, like little chocolate treats. Um, but yeah, I like to have that on hand. Up the back here, I've got some Next Bar um, soft drinks. Um, so I've got the lemon and I've got the raspberry. I put these um, with vodka. That's my drink of choice. So yeah, I got a few of them. It's a long weekend, so need some um, some drinks for that period of time. Um, we've got some a taco mix here. These are the ones of the boats. The boys like the boats, but the hubby doesn't. So he's got wraps that um, are in the cupboard. So he uses the wraps while the boys use those. And next we have this cheese. So this is the cheese I've been getting lately. So it's got mozzarella, Colby and Parmesan. Um, and it's a really um, decent um, macros. I'm not sure if I'm gonna be able to show you. Oh, there we go. So less than one gram of carb and sugar per serve. And it's got about seven grams per uh, fat. So that's pretty decent, I think, for keto. Um, you have to watch out with um, your already grated cheese because they do put like a um, like a flour in there to stop it from clumping. So just be aware of that when you're getting your grated cheese. Um, I did get some sour cream. That's the light sour cream for the boys and the hubby. And I've got the full fat sour cream. Um, they use it for tacos and stuff and I put it in my eggs also for my tacos or nachos all those kind of things. I got a couple of cream cheese for myself um, because I'll be making my um, broccoli and meat bake and this is what I use in the bake to make the cream sauce. Um, over here I got the banana bread. I really need to just make some banana muffins rather than buying these banana breads. They're $5 a packet, so that's $10 just there. I can make so many more muffins. So I really need to just pull my finger out and make some muffins. But that is what I've used. The, um, my boys like to have them for breakfast and sometimes they'll take it for lunch. Um, I got two loaves of bread. These are the bread that we like to get. It's nice and soft. Um, you, most of the time when you freeze them they work out well. I don't know lately they just haven't been up to scratch when you defrost them but um, yeah they're the ones that I use. Um, here I've got a couple of um, packs of eight poppers. I've got the orange and there's apple at the back there. This week I did buy some eggs 
We are down to two chickens now, so um, I had to buy some eggs. Plus, if you, um, if you do have chickens, you'll notice that the fresh eggs are, are a lot harder to boil. So I did get some um, of these, I did buy some eggs this week because I wanted to boil some and make some deviled eggs this weekend. Um, last up the back we've got another, oh they gave it, I got tropical and orange. I thought I actually got apple but that's okay, it's pretty similar. So apple and orange juice for the hubby, he likes these ones. And I also got some Kirk's lemon sugar free soft drink in the cans. So because um, yeah we got lots of Pepsi Max but we needed some, just some different flavours. So that is all the stuff that I bought. Um, it wasn't a very big shop this week, um, but that's all I needed. That was um, doing my meal prep, uh, my meal planning, and then buying what I needed from what's in my cupboard. Um, all up, I spent $212. And I really like um, picking my groceries up from Woolies online. They're really good with their substitutes, which doesn't happen that often. And I only have to pay a dollar for the bags and, and I just pick it up when I am ready to get it. Okay, I'm not sure if you can see very well, but this is my meal plan for this week. Um, so Friday is usually just having a big fry up. These ones are usually the same each week. Um, I have Taco Tuesday, hot dogs on a Wednesday like I was saying. And then I've just put in some different meals with, from using what was already in the freezer. So I had some chicken, I had some of these stuffed chickens, I had sausage, um, and I just had to buy the spaghetti, uh, the mince for the spaghetti and the mince for the tacos, had to buy hot dogs. And um, yeah, pretty much everything else we already had in the fridge. So that's why we didn't have to buy too much. Okay guys, so thanks for watching my video. Hope you enjoyed it. If you did, please give it a thumbs up. If you haven't already, please hit that subscribe. If you haven't already, please hit that subscribe button. And I will see you in the comments. Bye.